Why the giant X? Why the stupid face? Touche. You know, I know you knocked that exit sign down. Well, and I'm sure I can expect an appropriate retaliatory response. Maybe you could shoot me in the neck. <laughs> Sounds like fun, but no. Our game is over, buddy. Your residency's coming to a close, and that's it. Nothing left to do, but... What can I say? It's been horrifying. Thank you. Well, this is kind of cool. Maybe, you know, maybe we could, like, be friends. You like hunting squirrels? I'd never tried it. Easiest thing in the world. All you need is some walnuts and a boxing glove. Why the big X? Why the stupid face? Touche. You know what? I know it was you that uh, knocked down that exit sign. Oh, I'm sure I can uh, ex expect an appropriate retaliatory response. Maybe you could shoot me in the neck. <laughs> no, not going to do that. Our little fun is over. Your uh, residency is coming to a close, and uh, all that's left is this. What can I say? It's been horrifying. <laughs> this is great. Well, you know, maybe we can be friends. I don't know, maybe. You like hunting squirrels? Never tried it. It's easy. All you need is a pair of night vision goggles and a pair of squirrel strangling gloves. Huh. Will you just apply pressure around the neck? Cut! <laughs> and it was you that knocked out with that exit sign. Well, I guess I can expect an appropriate retaliatory response. Maybe when I have children, you could take their eyes. We'll see. We <laughs> <laughs> got hmm. again? Deadline? Yeah. Uh, I know you knocked down that exit sign. Well, I guess I can expect an appropriate retaliatory response. Maybe when I have children, you could take their eyes. Hmm. What are you doing? Just making it official. Chief. Co-chief. Uh, you can try as hard as you want. That is never going to stick. Hmm. Oh, and that's Co-Chief Resident Dorian over there. Damn it. You are quick. Damn it. That was fast. How did you do that? Wildfire. Call me. Wildfire. <laughs> Damn it. You are quick. They called me Wildfire in a big house. You're in prison? No, I grew up in a big house. Oh. <laughs> That's right. The Miracle Five. You take this from Perry. Great moment there, dumbass. It starts out with a profound misunderstanding of how the human body works and winds up with you shattering some old man's hand. Oh, yeah. Great moment there, Fonzie. It starts out with a profound misunderstanding of just exactly how the human body works and winds up with you mashing some older man's hand. Great moment there, monkey. It starts out with a profound... <laughs> Great moment there, monkey. It starts out with a profound misunderstanding of how the human body works and winds up with you shattering some old man's hand. Oh, yeah. What's this stretch good for? It loosens up my chest, but you should probably stretch too. Don't need to, buddy. I got a tuba bengay on each one of my hamstrings. How are things going with Kylie? They're OK. Is there some special way to get a black girl to like you? Dude, the only difference between a black girl and a white girl is that when a black girl asks you if our ass looks big, uh -huh. you say, hell yeah. All right. OK. You want to play some ball? Hell yes. What's this stretch good for? It loosens up my chest, but you should probably stretch too. Don't need to, buddy. I got a tuba bengay on each one of my hamstrings. How are things going with Kylie? They're OK. Is there some special way to get a black girl to like you? Dude, the only difference between a black girl and a white girl is that when a black girl asks you if her ass looks big, uh -huh. you say, hell yeah. All right. OK. You want to play some ball? Let's do it. Who are these guys? These, my friend, are the last eight guys in the hospital who still don't know I suck at basketball. Uh -huh. Here's what's going to happen. I finally mastered my running hook shot, OK? Uh -huh. So when we go to pick teams, I'm going to hit that shot. Then you say, I'll take that guy, at which point Carla is going to page me. And I'll say, crap, I got to go. And you go, damn, we just lost the best player out here. Then there'll be eight guys in the hospital who think I'm good at sports, and word will spread. When do you find time to see your patients? Between these thoughts. Oh. Uh, OK, let's play some ball. Ah, my hammy! Ben Gay in my eyes! Ben Gay in my eyes! I'll take that guy. She just stores everything up until my cheeks hit the seat. She thinks she's exempt from the rule. Nobody is exempt from the rule, JD. Okay, shh. It's okay. 
I'll never talk to you on the ground. Okay. I can't afford to soundproof my bathroom. Listen. Okay. Okay. Shh. It's okay. I'll never talk to you on the crap. Okay. Shh. I know. Let it all out. Just like you do on the crap. Okay. Now look. The way I cheered Turk up, find someone or thing. Come on. Come on. Let it all out. Like you're taking a doo doo. Let it all out. Like you're taking a toozy. All right. <laughs> you're absolutely right. It's my fault you kissed my wife. Oh, man, I'm going home. Who do you think you're talking to? You think you've been the world's greatest husband? Please. I was there when you were flirting with your ex-girlfriend neglected to tell you were married. I was there when you tried to hook up with that waitress the day before you got engaged. And I was definitely there when you hooked up with that nasty-ass stripper at Boobies, Boobies, Boobies. That wasn't me. That was you. I know, but I told her my name was Turk. And I was definitely there when you hooked up with that nasty asshole who worked at Subway. Whoa, whoa. That was you. And I was definitely there when you hooked up with that nasty-ass stripper at Boobies and Jugs. Wait a second, that was you.